New Life in the UK Test Chapter 3 Test 6 A Long and Illustrious History Early Britain The Middle Ages The Tudors and Stuarts A Global Power The 20th Century Britain since 1945 You have 45 minutes to answer 24 multiple choice life in the UK test questions. You need to answer at least 18 out of 24 questions correctly to pass. What happened in 1215 to change the powers of the king? A. Magna Carta B. The Black Death C. The Doomsday Book D. The Reform Act Correct answer, Magna Carta Explanation There were few formal limits to the king's power until 1215. In that year, King John was forced by his noblemen to agree to a number of demands. The result was a charter of rights called the Magna Carta, which means the Great Charter, which two were great thinkers of the Enlightenment. A. Adam Smith. B. David Hume. C. Robert Burns. D. Robert Louis Stevenson. Correct answer, Adam Smith and David Hume. Explanation, many of the great thinkers of the Enlightenment were Scottish. Adam Smith developed ideas about economics which are still referred to today. David Hume's ideas about human nature continue to influence philosophers who invaded England in 1066. A. Canute. B. Harold of Wessex. C. Richard the Lionheart. D. William of Normandy. Correct answer, William of Normandy. Explanation, in 1066, an invasion led by William, the Duke of Normandy, in what is now northern France, defeated Harold, the Saxon King of England, at the Battle of Hastings. Is the statement below true or false? Margaret Thatcher was the longest-serving UK Prime Minister of the 20th century. A. False. B. True. Correct answer, true. Explanation, she was the longest-serving Prime Minister of the 20th century, remaining in office until 1990. Which of these statements is correct? A. The Highland clearances occurred in Ireland. B. The Highland clearances occurred in Scotland. Correct answer. The Highland clearances occurred in Scotland. Explanation. A process began which became known as the Highland Clearances. Many Scottish landlords destroyed individual small farms, known as crofts, to make space for large flocks of sheep and cattle. What was the Beveridge Report of 1942 about? A. Establishing a welfare state. B. How to end the war in Europe. C. How to treat the Germans and Japanese after the war. D. Overseas aid. Correct answer, establishing a welfare state. Explanation, it recommended that the government should find ways of fighting the five giant evils of want, disease, ignorance, squalor and idleness and provided the basis of the modern welfare state. Which two points about slavery are correct? A. Quakers set up the first anti-slavery groups. B. Slavery survived in the British Empire until the early 20th century. C. The Royal Navy refused to stop ships carrying slaves. D. William Wilberforce was a leading abolitionist. Correct answer. Quakers set up the first anti-slavery groups. William Wilberforce was a leading abolitionist. Explanation. The first formal anti-slavery groups were set up by the Quakers in the late 1700s, and they petitioned Parliament to ban the practice. William Wilberforce, an evangelical Christian and a member of Parliament, also played an important part in changing the law. Along with other abolitionist people who supported the abolition of slavery, he succeeded in turning public opinion against the slave trade. Which country did Germany invade in 1939 that led to the UK declaring war on Germany? A. Austria. B. Finland. C. France. D. Poland. Correct answer, Poland. Explanation. The British government tried to avoid another war. However, when Hitler invaded Poland in 1939, Britain and France declared war in order to stop his aggression. Hadrian's Wall was built to keep out whom? A. The Irish. 
B. The Picts. C. The Vikings. D. The Welsh. Correct answer. The Picts. Explanation. Areas of what is now Scotland were never conquered by the Romans, and the Emperor Hadrian built a wall in the north of England to keep out the Picts, ancestors of the Scottish people. Dylan Thomas was a famous writer and poet from which country? A. England. B. Northern Ireland. C. Scotland. D. Wales. Correct answer. Wales. Explanation. Dylan Thomas was a Welsh poet and writer. Which colonies of British Empire decided to declare their independence in 1776? A. American. B. Australian. C. Canadian. D. South African. Correct answer, American. Explanation, in 1776, 13 American colonies declared their independence, stating that people had a right to establish their own governments. Which two groups contested the Wars of the Roses in the 15th century? A. House of Lancaster. B. House of York. C. Irish. D. Scottish. Correct answer, House of Lancaster and House of York. Explanation, in 1455, a civil war was begun to decide who should be King of England. It was fought between the supporters of two families, the House of Lancaster and the House of York. Is the statement below true or false? During the Great Depression of the 1930s, the UK had high levels of employment. A. False. B. True. Correct answer, false. Explanation, however, in 1929, the world entered the Great Depression, and some parts of the UK suffered mass unemployment. Which two genres is William Shakespeare famous for writing? A. Plays. B. Poems. C. Radio scripts. D. TV dramas. Correct answer, plays and poems. Explanation. Shakespeare was born in Stratford-upon-Avon, England. He was a playwright and actor and wrote many poems and plays. Is the statement below true or false? Catherine Howard was the sixth wife of Henry VIII. A. False. B. True. Correct answer. False. Explanation. Catherine Howard. Catherine was a cousin of Anne Boleyn. She was also accused of taking lovers and executed. Which of these statements is correct? A. James VI of Scotland was not related to Queen Elizabeth I of England. B. James VI of Scotland was related to Queen Elizabeth I of England. Correct answer. James VI of Scotland was related to Queen Elizabeth I of England. Explanation. Elizabeth I never married and so had no children of her own to inherit her throne. When she died in 1603 her heir was her cousin James VI of Scotland. Which two are 20th century British discoveries or inventions? A. Diesel engine. B. Mobile phone. C. Television. D. World Wide Web. Correct answer. Television and World Wide Web. Explanation. The television was developed by Scotsman John Logie Baird, 1888-1946, in the 1920s. The inventor of the World Wide Web. Sir Tim Berners-Lee, 1955, is British. What happened to Margaret Thatcher in 1979 to make her famous in UK history? A. She became a High Court judge. B. She became the first woman Prime Minister. C. She took part in the Olympics. D. She was made a general in the British Army. Correct answer. She became the first woman Prime Minister. Explanation. Following the Conservative victory in the general election in 1979, Margaret Thatcher became the first woman Prime Minister of the UK. Which of these statements is correct? A. Shakespeare wrote to be or not to be. B. Shakespeare wrote, We will fight them on the beaches. Correct answer. Shakespeare wrote to be or not to be. Explanation. Lines from his plays and poems which are often still quoted include Once more unto the breach, Henry V. To be or not to be, Hamlet. A rose by any other name, Romeo and Juliet. All the world's a stage, as you like it. 
the darling buds of May. Sonnet 18 Shall I compare thee to a summer's day? Who did Henry VIII marry after the execution of Anne Boleyn? A. Anne of Cleves. B. Catherine Howard. C. Catherine Parr. D. Jane Seymour. Correct answer, Jane Seymour. Explanation, Jane Seymour. Henry married Jane after Anne's execution. She gave Henry the son he wanted, Edward. But she died shortly after the birth. The Enlightenment led to major development in which two areas? A. History. B. Politics. C. Science. D. Theatre. Correct answer, politics and science. Explanation. During the 18th century, new ideas about politics, philosophy and science were developed. This is often called the Enlightenment. Is the statement below true or false? The First World War ended at 11 a.m. on the 11th of November 1918. A. False. B. True. Correct answer. True. Explanation. The First World War ended at 11 a.m. on the 11th of November 1918 with victory for Britain and its allies. Is the statement below true or false? Britain and Germany developed Concorde, a passenger supersonic aircraft. A. False. B. True. Correct answer. False. Explanation. Britain and France developed Concorde, the world's only supersonic passenger aircraft. Which of these statements is correct? A. The War of the Roses was between the Houses of Lancaster and York. B. The Wars of the Roses were between the Houses of Windsor and Tudor. Correct answer. The War of the Roses was between the Houses of Lancaster and York. Explanation. In 1455, a civil war was begun to decide who should be King of England. It was fought between the supporters of two families, the House of Lancaster and the House of York. Hope you like this video. Please feel free to write your suggestions in comment section for future videos. Please like, share and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching this video.